I got an evaluation coming up. For ADHD? You keep for talking about this. Mental- yeah, February something. I can't um, wait for those test results to come back. Me either. Me either. Oh, you, you know what's going to happen? I'm absolutely not. Nah. I'm, I'm perfectly fine as a person. <laughs> He's no can you, can you attest to this? I mean, you would know more than I would. It's, it's nothing something. wrong with me. Yeah. At all. It's literally not. You, you can't. Even. He's even. No, you yeah, right. you can't. So from what, just from the past 20 minutes and from seeing y'all's show, I would evaluate it as you're more so, y'all both like ain't rowdy. No, no, no we but you're rowdy. more of the calm spirit than Lair is. Yeah, yeah. I feel like Lair will like, I don't know, Lair probably like. Yes, Lair. I love it. He didn't say Lair, though. Time, it's okay. He didn't say Lair. It's he okay. didn't. Keep going. Keep That's probably just my accent. Le- is, what is, how's it pronounced? It's just Lair. But Lair? It's okay. yeah, I can't say Lair. No, you're fine, but go ahead. Keep going. <laughs> I feel like you'll be, you'll be, and correct me if I'm wrong, I feel like Lair will be more the type to suck a bitch asshole with a straw. Yes, <laughs> before you were. Uh, yeah, absolutely. But Lido get smacked, so it's like it, it's a. That's it's different. A, it's not different. Get nah, smacked. Like yeah. get smacked is where I draw the line. What's I, oh get smacked by a shirty? <laughs> like actually get yeah, smacked. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. smacked me. Yeah. All right. What does that do for you? It does everything, brother. Yeah. It turned it turn me up. Yeah. I love that shit. Get that yeah, I like. I like. It. It's a nice little adrenaline rush. It's yeah. like um. What's that? The little pins that people use, like epi pins, to try to wake them up. That's mm-hmm. crazy. That's what it feels like. Like you know, because sometimes sex it don't get boring, but sometimes you'll realize that you you need that shock value to kind of uh, get you there. To get yeah. Do you like to get choked? Yes. Okay. That's my that's my bag. Put your uh. little put them little stupid fingers around my neck. You know the little, little, little small fingers. fingers. <laughs> yeah. So Shorties be having fingers. little small yeah, girl yeah. fingers, and, and they shit. like to go for the choke too. I be telling Shorties, I'm like, nah, don't choke me. I don't like to get choked. It depends if she got little if she got little woman hands. Mm-hmm. I'll take it because some women hands be like half my hand size, mm-hmm. so the choke be kind of like a touch. It don't really be it be a real <laughs> choke. No, it's they be like, trying to. They be no. no they I'm go talking about I'm talking about I'm talking women that really want to choke. Yeah, they'll go for it. They'll try your ass out to see how far they can go. Shout out to my big hand. My big hand bitches. I was about to see big hand bitches, but I said it. Shout out to my big hand women. Okay. You know what I'm saying? They'll choke you, but it felt like a nigga trying to choke you out. Yeah, I don't. I, that's I, what I'm saying. I'm not cool with that. I'll do the choking. I'll do the slapping. Yeah. Oh, I'm, you're I'm, doing it. Yeah, I'm gonna use yeah, my. Why? Why I'm can't use, it be done? Done? You know, equal done equal brother. Equal opportunity. Uh, <laughs> Am yeah, I being biased? Yeah, I'm yeah, being biased. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. I just. I'm good. I don't need pain inflicted on me for me to feel good. It's already the yeah. easy. So you yeah. might not be that might not be a joint though. Like yeah. Uh, so you got like a I don't mind getting bit though. See, brother, what's happening? I here? don't know. Choking yeah, by the cause that's that's my airway. I don't know. Maybe it's yeah, subconsciously yeah. fucking me up. But biting, I don't mind if she bite me. Yeah. Y'all like your nipples lick? Like shorty nick it licking nipples? Yeah, absolutely. I have uh, before I didn't see it. Mm-hmm. Now I see it. That's that shit. Yeah. I, I like my, it a little I bit. I like it a lot of it. Man. That's that shit. That's yeah, a new nigga foreplay. Yeah. I'm gonna use my Philly term right now, freak balls. We got some freak balls. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> let me get this let me get this introduction proper. Sorry. What to do, everybody, and thanks for tuning in to the day by day podcast for your day by day broadcast. I'm your host with Day with a I, not a Y, do not X Y. And today I have a special one for y'all and my Myself because, ladies and gentlemen, we are joined by one of the hottest podcasts in the nation, and that Yay. is not an understatement. Straight out of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, ladies and gentlemen, we are joined by Lair and Lionel. Yay! Yay. Day, that was pretty that good. Was really good. That was intro. really that was good. good. Whoa! Thank you, thank you. I take pride. Here. I take pride in the introductions, and I'm like kind of consulting people how to run podcasts. I say. The introduction starts it off because it spreads that good energy. Because when you have a good intro and your guests be like, damn, I like that introduction, yeah. just like y'all they'll, did. They'll interact. It just better. raise the dopa- yeah. dopamines, whatever the fuck. Them Meanwhile, we so, don't even intro niggas. So, so all right. Y'all just jump all right. So the same way, the same way that you explain how intros work mm-hmm. here in the podcast space, how does your intro work in the bedroom? Mm. What would your intros be? That boy good. Come on, yes. man. Look, yes. how does the podcaster become a podcaster, yeah, yeah. brother? Yeah, exactly. Straight to it. Sometimes you got a poison on. To my, poor son, because, <laughs> because you was a poor son. <laughs> Honestly, my, my, no, nah, I haven't. No, I haven't. Yeah, I'm lost in the sauce. All right, that's why we going to show that. It's supposed to be said that on okay. um, drink champs. But okay, ahead. yeah, that's why I wasn't engaged with the laughter. Oh, by the way, before I answer that, Desi is joining us today. As y'all can see, What's she's up, up underneath yeah. Lair's legs for the first time. I think it's the first time she's made a cameo on here. So, welcome to the show, Des. Oh. All right, to answer your question, <laughs> me personally, I like to manifest the draws. So I manifest the movement for us going upstairs, going to my room. I manifest how I'm going to lay it down and everything, but I make it as a surprise. Mm-hmm. And it's kind of fucking me up for saying this on wax, but whatever. 
I, I like to lay it in surprise, so I'll say such and such. Let me give you a house tour. He's oh, like, you for real. okay, yeah, that's pretty <laughs> that's good. I do, I do the house that's tour. I do the house tour, yeah. and I set up my room beforehand to have the ambiance of just it has a to be very aesthetically pleasing. Absolutely, right. yeah, okay. absolutely. I just bought the LED smart lamp for a reason. So I'll go to the room. I already got the you know what I'm saying the cologne sprayed in the air, the Febreze, the whole oh, deal. Oh, brother's good. Yeah. yeah. So then when we go in there, it goes from there. I kind of feel the vibe out from there, but I usually like some way somehow. Whether we talking or whether she looking at something, I just creep up behind her, get up behind her, fill up on her so she can fill up on me, and then we go from there. <laughs> hey, bro, bro got a, a solid brother. Plan. All yeah, team here. Yeah, I yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah. I used Come to on. go to tour, and I had a one bedroom apartment like in West Philly, but it always worked. And be like, you want to see the rest of the crib? He'd be like, yeah, I take him to the big yeah. ass kitchen. I never touched. Take him around, show him my little trap door to the bedroom. The kitchen, the ki- trap door to the so bedroom. Yeah, I got crazy. You. I, had, I had two doors to my bathroom and shit. Damn, and I used to, uh, the LED light, though, the trick is, I used to be like, yo, what's your favorite color? Mm. Like, All right, now, like here's pink. where I have to stop him. Because he stole I did steal that light. my I stole, light. I got plenty, I got plenty, plenty of me, plenty good nights. Yeah. I bought lights for the podcast. <laughs> Okay. Right. Yeah. Podcast purposes, because that's our whole thing. Is like you know neon lights, yeah, late night with Lionel, right, right. whatever. I'm like, bro, we are gonna have two lights. One coming from this direction. Boom, boom, boom. I bought both of those lights because we used to record at his house. Mm-hmm. And then one day, it just mysteriously one of them went missing. Yeah. yeah. And then I look in his room, and it's the, posted. It's the light. What color do you use? Mainly. It. Hmm. I would say like some combination between pink and red. Yeah, like red some, is, something between pink and red. I don't red does red. something to something in our neural system to get some horny more. Red is sexy. It's a very aggressive color, but it's yeah. like sexy though. It's like I think it's warm. Like red is warm and like sexy and yeah. just like think about red. it. That silhouette challenge thing that they was doing. Oh, that was red. red. Yeah. yeah, that yeah. wouldn't work with a yellow light and no shit like that. Nah, nah it wouldn't. It wouldn't work with like a blue light. Or That's, mm, cold. I'm not mad at blue. I Rose. like purple. Purple was my Purple's shit. nice too. Purple was my Purple's shit. nice too. I think it has some red in it. Um, real quick, we're gonna mm-hmm. get back on topic with that. Yes. I just gotta say, this is a very full circle moment. I okay. gotta give y'all flowers <laughs> right quick while y'all here. Right. So about a year, I've been podcasting for three years. About a year and a half ago, I wasn't gaining any traction with my reels. I just started. I'm like, all right, what do I do? I saw a video that said type in podcast or black podcast on TikTok and IG and kind of, you know, see what they're doing that you're not. I do. I find y'all page and I'm just binging it. And one thing I noticed, the first thing I noticed with y'all's was y'all captions. Mm -hmm. The reason why I do Mm -hmm. captions today is because of y'all's clips. And this is why I like when people actually say, you know what I'm saying? We appreciate it, brother. We appreciate it. Yeah, 100%. But not only that, y'all captions aren't just captions because y'all have captions and then y'all have like sidebar messages like- yes. Close, yes. like like yeah, hidden yes. gems inside yep. of it as well. Yes, which is like on point. Joke yeah, exactly. Screen, Insiders. Yeah. There we go. So I just had to say, you know what I'm saying this full circle for me, binging y'all shit, seeing how the captions work. The reason why I do captions now, and if y'all are making reels or clips, put captions in. People are lazy now; they want to read instead of hearing, it, especially on IG. So yeah. I just had to shout but y'all that, out for that. I, I appreciate that because motherfuckers you. don't be showing no love and you mean, but nah. you, we don't do it for that anyway. But just to say, like the caption portion. Um, it adds personality to the clip, mm-hmm. but also you gotta think about um, deaf people too. Ah. I thought about that like maybe like a year ago because mm-hmm. somebody messaged me and told me like, "I'm glad y'all put these here because I'm deaf," and I was oh, like, "Oh." Wow. So now, because there's a point where I just started like saying like, "I'm not about to do this shit" because mm-hmm. it takes effort. Yeah. Do you but, make Do you make them? You yeah. Do them? yeah. Okay. So I, luckily, but this before. Um, Niggas was doing auto captions. Now that's every, everything yeah. auto caption now. Yeah. You could do it on, even on Premiere now. Yeah. Okay. Like they made you could do it before, but now they make it real easy. <clears throat> okay. So like, but we was doing it before that. So we was typing it. Uh remember we was typing it on the phone too. Yes, every we every, every word. Every word. Really? Every word. Yeah. yeah. So I did wow. it for like that and deaf people too, just to kind of I don't want to alienate no audience. Podcasting yeah. is definitely a process. That's and when you go back and look at all of your old videos throughout the time compared mm-hmm. to like now, yeah. you realize like all of the shit that you went through. Cause just you telling talking about we used to post every word, like we used to type in word every for single word. That is word crazy. I'm not gonna lie, that is in crazy. In the very beginning. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And we was like, there's gotta be a better way. So then we did it sentences. Sentence by sentence. And yeah. then you wake up and now there's like AI. Yeah. And you're like, dog. The thing about AI though, because um I had tried to download uh one of them video editing Jones, but I that's why I like you just gotta put the work in because a lot of that shit make everybody clips look like 
You know, it's no, it's no brand identity. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So with the no, joint, yeah, I think course. it's Opus that I downloaded. It gives everybody the same font and color, like different okay. variations of the same font color. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. And it turns your shit, uh, make your shit look a little robotic. And y'all did that. Y'all did that. I don't know if y'all still do, but when I was like binging y'all captions, when I was really studying y'all captions, y'all did different colors, right? For who was based off of who was talking. Well, yeah, that was way back. I was just yeah. so I, oh, that was me. trying to like real hard. Oh real man, hard. Yeah. Okay. brother, yeah, yeah. you yeah. going all the way back? Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I, I think I was doing like yellow for you or pink for you and white for me or something like that back then. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, but I ain't doing that shit no more. How'd y'all meet? At my, uh, at my, um, I was about to lie. I'm a bad Yeah, high school. We didn't meet in high school. We went to the same high school together. Mm -hmm. Um, but we weren't like close in high school. We just knew of each other. Mm Mm-hmm. But yeah. then outside of that, I had a podcast. Wait, wait, wait. Um, years later, though. Yeah, years so we later. So graduated high school in 2011, 12. Okay. Yeah. I was 13. And I met, re-met Lionel at. Excuse me? 13. That's how old you was? No, us no I t- class of 23. Oh, all right. I was about oh, to say. Nah, 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 bro, oh, I did say I was 13. Man, yeah, you did. I brother. did just say I was 13. Nah, <laughs> class of 13. Class say. of 13. Nah, nah, nah. All right, go ahead, go ahead. My bad, so, my bad. Um, but, so we graduated high school. And I, we re met in 2018. Yeah. Yeah, he got a go ahead, you can tell I, I, Well, I had a podcast um at the time called Aggressively Passive. There was there was um spitting bars. There was a rapper. Up. I was rapping. Right. Yeah, there was yeah, rapping yeah. and I had bought him on the show. I'm like, it was him and, and the rest of his uh yeah, rap geez, collective. Yeah. Shout out to EBN. Yeah. Yeah. Um yeah, and, and then you know, my sister was like, Yo, y'all y'all kinda got like some good uh, chemistry. Yeah, mm-hmm. y'all got good chemistry. And um, he was just like, all right, we should do a podcast. Do y'all see that y'all have progressed more? Well, obviously I have, but spit it anyway. Have y'all progressed more coming together as a group with a co-host or individually? And I ask because people yeah. like me, I, I don't have a co-host. I would like one one day, but I just haven't found that mesh. I thought I found one back in Maryland, but I moved out here. But mm. since y'all found that mesh and it was like, okay, it only makes sense. Right, like, do y'all yeah. think some people should keep going that route or stay to themselves with it? I wouldn't. Have, I mean, I wouldn't have started a podcast by myself. Mm-hmm. So it's like, yeah. As far as like partnering up, I didn't. Lionel was podcasting. I wouldn't have did it. Like, if you if you didn't say like if you didn't initiate like the the setup and all that type of shit, I probably yeah. you know what I'm saying. Yeah, so it just yeah. would have never happened. So I think that uh, collaboration is better than. Being by yourself, especially podcasting, because oh. it's a lot to carry. Also, like, having like the uh, well, we don't really like disagree yeah. too often, mm-hmm. like rarely. But it's nice to have like other opinions in the room. Yeah, having different like um personalities, somebody to kind of bounce off of. Pause. Boom. Yeah. That was crazy. That was crazy. <laughs> My bad. Um, but it's it's definitely nice to have that. You know. Yeah, yeah, it is. It is, and I um I appreciate doing it by myself. But I also like that it's different personalities. But at the same time, I be I be meeting people on the spot, like yeah. when I do these. So I don't know yeah. what's about to happen until they oh, come true. through the door and yeah, we sit down and chop it up. True. Yeah. You know what I mean? So it would be better to have like a little bit more cohesiveness. But you know what though? We do and we have get like when you get guests that mm-hmm. you kinda don't like mm-hmm. or whatever, and yeah. then like we got twenty minutes in, you'll realize it. I'm not going to tell who if you go back and look at certain episodes, but mm-hmm. like me and Larry will start the whole conversations with each other mm-hmm. instead of talking to the guests mm-hmm. because the guest has become So what are some annoying. of the biggest... Okay, so how can a guest that comes on your podcast be annoying? What are some red flags for a guest? Uh, so I think, speaking on that, <laughs> real shit... Bro, to give up tape. <laughs> no, no, I was telling can, ourselves. No, we, uh, so we I'm going to do the same. We do pretty well as far as like... <laughs> If somebody come up and they on some bullshit, or even if we go on somebody else's podcast, mm-hmm. like we didn't been in people's rooms and like realize they suck at this, mm. and we just oh, got that's not t- nice. And we well, you know I see nice. no names, but we gotta like we talk now. We now me and Lionel kind of controlling the conversation. Yeah. But as far as our guests, sometimes people try to get like super competitive with the freak shit, and it's like yeah, you know, they, they gotta be that's organic for yeah. like we just talking yeah, shit. It can be natural. Yeah. yeah, yeah like, don't be. don't come don't force it. Like yeah. we gonna get to that. And also, some people just be like combative, like with everything. Or I don't know. It just Wait, you can't you've converse. had people that you like, um, 
you thought was like normal? Because I, I guess like as human beings, we're just supposed to like expect certain things from people. Yeah. yeah. And then they Thomas get says. there and you talk to them and then you're like, oh shit, you're kind of weird. Like, yeah. you know what I'm yeah. saying? Like, yeah. damn, that's kind of crazy. I don't so, like you. <laughs> yeah, I, like, I, I, yeah like, I like the part where you said where they forcing it because people will try to force, especially like they yeah, know absolutely. what your podcast is based off of. Yeah. Right. Mine is kind of just go with the vibe. Yeah. But when they force it, you're like, all right, let's let's. You know what I'm saying? They can feel it when you force it. Let's kind of wind it I'll back. Be, yeah. And once we get there, just, we get there. I just look at them. Yeah. Like, and look let them go? The no, I'll be... We, oh, you I, say you look I'm at I'm not going to say an episode, but me and Lionel was just making faces at each other. It was... um. Well, you're not going to know now, but... You can good. I can bleep it out. No, you don't have to bleep it out. Oh, all right. Who? Oh, yeah, that was crazy. Like, so he was like... <laughs> yeah, that was okay, crazy. Because also, I like alcohol. Alcohol... Plays a it like you said, we were talking about like how you know alcohol could turn somebody up, mm -hmm. and you start to gradually see it. Mm -hmm. We do a podcast that's an hour and 45, sometimes two hours long, yeah. yeah. You know, yeah, an hour in a drinking, yeah, taking and shots hit, and stuff like that. People it. are just like, oh my god, and they're yeah. talking over, yeah, yeah. That's when you one. had because it's, it's already two of us here, right? Three voices is nice. Four is a crowd, four is, four is a you know, you're going crazy. Yeah. Five, you know, so like when you got people like just talking over each other, it just gets like, yeah. like you it's said, nasty. it's a little competitive. Yeah. It's so like, people try to drink before they get there. Um, and I think that they drinking like they never drank before. Mm. And I don't think you should do that. You should probably drink the no <laughs> normal way you drink. Yeah. Because when you get here, you either incoherent or you like, you sit yeah. there like, what yeah. I like, yeah. What I like to do is, first off, I like to drink wine during it, or have my guests oh, drink wine. wine. Is good. That's so I good. have a big ass jug of wine downstairs. Um, I didn't bring it up because I've been drinking in a minute, but I'll have a big ass jug of wine and I'll wait till they get here. Yeah. If they want to drink before, cool, that's on them. But like you said, I don't want them to pull up drunk. Right. And I'll be mm -hmm. like, let's sip on some wine if they're nervous, because a lot of people, it's different when these lights and cameras that's for the first it. time. True. It's different. Yeah. Y'all remember the very first time y'all did this shit? That shit was different. No. Unless y'all were just naturals. Who's in the house? <laughs> y'all was what? okay. Y'all was cool. I was I was nervous and shit when I first time started. We got lights oh, on the first time we lights and cameras. Oh yeah, I was nervous yeah. as fuck. Yeah, I was yeah, sloppy yeah, drunk. Yeah. You I was nervous? Hold, hell yeah. That's what I oh, was nervous. Um, not with our pod. Yeah, Cause I'm I was doing nervous. it for two years. I guess when I did it, I'm talking my about very first yeah, one? yeah, very 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 first, first oh, okay. time. Yeah. yeah, not really. I was pilt off the hand. Yeah, yeah. Why you scared? I don't know. Because okay. it was it was new. I've just never done anything like that. Yeah, I don't mind yeah. like attention and doing it, but it was just something yeah. new. So it kind of caught me off guard. I can see that. So that's all that was. But moral of the story, uh, if you're featuring on someone's podcast, just let it ebb and flow. Yeah, sure, yeah. Or nothing. Just yeah. let it flow. Like a lot of my episodes, especially with ones that do have a lot of sex talk, those come from out of nowhere. Yeah. Like, cause yeah. I'll have notes for something completely different, but then, you know, women, they, they want to talk their shit. So yeah. when they do, I yeah. kind of just go from there. You know what I'm saying? They point in the direction, then I'll turn the wheel, and then we go down that road. Let me ask you a question. Mm -hmm. We on, on our podcast, niggas thought it was crazy that sometimes I like to go ass first, right? I like to go, I go in and I eat the ass first, and I get to the rest. Okay, ass first is kind of crazy. Ass first is not crazy. Ass, ass first, ass, ass first means this you is know a metaphor, you, right? You know what you came no, to do. It's literally you ass go first. You eating ass first. You talking about eating ass first? Are we literally? Eating no, ass? no, he's talking I'm about eating ass, ass first. In first. Brother, it came no, no. so far out of nowhere that th that's why he's confused. Oh no! He, he are so we talking podcast terms or see, exactly. sex? Because you you just went out of nowhere into a new topic, brother. You confused? This is what I do. I'm with it. I'm with it. I'm with you. I just want to make sure I'm on the right road. I just want to make a metaphor. I just want to make. Show him the wrong, the right road. Boise was. He said, mm, "That's first." Are we, yeah. Are we, cause, are we talking podcasts or no, sex? We're talking, about we're sex. talking about sex. All right, go ahead. Go ahead. I like to go ass. Sometimes, if, if, like I got say on the pod, if mm -hmm. the ass fat, mm -hmm. I'm eating ass first. Sometimes mm -hmm. I'm going straight in. I'm spreading, then I'm doing the rest. Mm -hmm. I don't think that's crazy. I think that's some regular shit. It's interesting you brought that up. I had a shout out to Coco. I had Coco's oh, cool. on there. She has OnlyFans. And she has a fat ass. Okay. And she actually complained about this very topic. She mm. said, why do dudes go straight to my ass when all this pussy here? Because she we, said, we excited. It's yo, a fat yo. ass butt. What do you mean? No, she I said, agree with her. She said it's a turn off. I'm just telling you what she said. I agree with her. You got you to base the turkey a little bit, brother. Hey, fuck it, Coco. You got to you gotta base the turkey, brother. You got to get it nice and, you know, you got to warm the ass up a little bit. there, but that's when you get to eat the pussy from the back. 
Cause well, the, I would start from eating a route from the back first, and then no, I gotta get, I gotta start, then, st- then start yeah. credit card swiping, yeah. and then eating the ass. Credit card swiping. I like, I, like, I, like, I, like, I like to pay first. I like credit card swiping. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's like pretty the, good. I like to pay first, my brother. <laughs> yeah, big Amex guy over here. That's just a, I am. It's I like that. What's <laughs> uh, credit card swipe? Black I like cards. a little credit card swipe. Man, yeah, I liked it. Yeah. It was pretty good. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not mad at you. I mean, listen. Sometimes life is about risk. Definitely. I mean, you see how he said it's a risk, bro. That's crazy. Have you gotten more uh, complaints or compliments love. off of going to F as first? Hella love. <laughs> a lot of love. Did, I swear to God. I swear to God. Be, they love. Be like, they be like this. It, it, it hit me with the mm. It's like, yeah. And now that mm, that oomph is confirmation that I that I caught him off guard and it's time to rock and roll. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I, yeah, listen, that's more crazy, it, I bro. I don't eat it for no. I got you. I got you. But you I go just, straight there. Right, that's like all right. Imagine, go imagine the shirt. You, uh, you know, shirt. Get down on her knees. You think she about to eat my ass? She, no, you think she about to, you know, suck him off crazy. Excuse and then she ass. just hit the gooch. You gonna be like, wait a minute, too fast. I'm not mad at that. Gooch first is I'm crazy. Not mad at gooch first. I, I never be gooch like first. God. Yeah, I never had gooch first, but I had balls first. And balls that shit turned me the fuck on. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, it did. Turns you off. On. Oh, so ball imagine. Kind of crazy. So just imagine how they feel. You got this pussy right there. You gonna eat the ass first? Damn, ass first. brother, what the fuck? No, it's ass. like eating your desserts first. Yeah, first. Head brother, head brother first. you gotta eat the food. If the, yeah, but if the, like I said, if the ass fit, I just gotta. I gotta smell it. I gotta get in there, and smell it, and, and you get can brown nose it. You can eat it from the back. But listen, man, we you know life is love, man. Life is love. <laughs> <laughs> life is love. Let me ask y'all something. Yes, he got cue cards, y'all. He professional. He is professional. I was gonna say. I got you notes. should send me your uh your logo. I'll send you. I'm starting to. I'm oh, so start to, giving, to brand. I'm gonna start giving thing. out gifts more yeah. often to yeah. people because I don't feel like I don't do that. Yeah, Plus, I, I heard that somebody that I know mm-hmm. be like gifting people stuff. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and it's such a good touch. Yeah, so I'll send me your logo so I can get you some cue cards some on cards. the back. I appreciate yeah. that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll be loved. I'm gonna holler at you. I appreciate that. Yeah, yes. yes. do that. So, yeah, I'll do it for sure. So there was a recent video about a chick saying how dudes that run a train on a chick is weird. She probably even called it gay. But then in the same breath, she said, I don't know how this made sense, but she said a threesome is not gay with two dudes and a girl. It was kind of contradicting. I, I'll pull up the actual video, but have y'all seen it? it was on Twitter? No. no I ain't seen that shit. Let me pull that shit. And I see, I'm, I'm usually like the Twitter guy. Yeah, I, usually, see, I, I see, see stuff that on general. Twitter. So, My thing is do you this think that though. people have just become podcasters just to say things? Yeah, one hundred percent. I mean, people don't gotta have no no actual equipment either to like get on there and see stuff. And here, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. All right. This, don't fuck. I'm gonna start this off by saying real niggas don't fuck bitches with other niggas in the room. Real straight niggas don't do that. Okay, real men. Real men don't do that. Secondly, if you and your nigga and a bitch all in one fucking room and everybody is being sexual or everybody in the room right now is getting sex something sexually done to them, like example, your man's is getting his dick sucked, you're hitting it from the back, that is a fucking threesome. That is not a train. A train okay. is when she is in the room, you hit, you exit, and another man enters oh. afterwards. That's a train. But yeah. if all three of you, collectively, whether you and the other man are not touching or not, okay, are actively having sex all in the same room, she's giving you oral sex, and he's hitting it from the back, that is a fucking threesome. I said what I said. It's simple. It's fucking simple. I think I agree with that a little bit. So she's, yeah, basically she's saying threesome verse train. What's y'all take on that? I think that anything that you're doing with a woman is not gay. Um, If you're doing a, what is it called? If you're doing a train and you're not touching no nigga, then I don't think that's gay. Like Threesome or train? According to her, uh, threesome is in the same room? But some people call a threesome with two niggas a train. Yeah, that's how I see it. I see a train as, um, you can say a train is you each take turns in the room one after the other. But I see that I see it as you can be in the same room yeah. with two guys and a girl, and it's still a train, yeah, still a threesome. You can call it whatever you want, but I mean, I don't know. Three, threesome yeah, is I, when all three are involved, which is why we say a threesome is with two girls and a dude because the yeah. girls are getting down on each other. We it's like a trifecta, but if it's two dudes and a girl, and the dudes ain't doing nothing with each other, but they only doing stuff to the girl, I see that as a train. 
Oh, so in order for it to be a threesome, everybody's got to be, be doing, doing something. something. Okay. That's what oh, I'm okay. That's what that makes that do yeah, sense. Yeah, that though. does to, that does make sense. To me, what y'all takes on it? I think I I think I agree with that. I think um, I mean, when you think about what an actual train is outside of sex, is people getting on and then off. Mm -hmm. So that's why I thought that. You go into a room, you, you get off. Yeah. That's literally how I thought trains worked in mm -hmm. my mind. So when people was like, yeah, we trained her, mm -hmm. that meant like Shorty was in the room, my man came in, he came mm -hmm. out, you know, tagged me in, that slap, boom, go in. Yeah. Boom. It's just like how trains work. You go, you pay, you get on, you yeah. get off, you get on, you get off. Like, that's how I thought it worked. But so, so that's why I kind of agree with her. Contrary, but contrary to, to topics like that, as far as like how she was even presenting that, it's like, we asked a question on our story a while ago, and it's a lot of women's fantasies to be fucked by two niggas. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know, like they say, like, I just want two niggas to 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 to, to head away with me, this, that, and the third. Mm -hmm. And these from the mobs of the women. Yeah. So yeah. it's like it just depends on the type of woman you around and you dealing with. She her she seemed like she was ready to get that viral moment cracking, which is cool. It seems like but, she's already been in a threesome. Yeah. According yeah. to her terminology like of three she was right we yeah. would probably call it a train but it seems like she's already did that people probably bashed her and she tried to say no i wasn't in a train i was in a threesome it's a difference but yeah they wanted just like we wanted men i think every man's fantasy is to have a threesome i would have one mm. i would have it yes i would have it i'm, women, not, I'm right? not turning it down yeah okay what yeah. was the hesitation for um i don't know if i yo it's a lot i feel like it's a lot yeah so I, I have it's one a before. thousand of you. It's only one of me. Yeah, you like, are you, you are know, multitasking. It's a lot of work. It's a lot yeah. of hands. You are multitasking. My yeah. thing, like I imagine, no, it's magic. It what was that movie you did? Hit that one more time. Yeah, I don't I know, know who's up here. Somebody, I don't know, I don't know who here. pussy is up there too. It's, things is happening. Is how, how is she up there? <laughs> he, she upside down. Brother, I don't okay. even know. Some she upside All down. Right. Okay, <laughs> but no, I think as far as that go, like I feel like my 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 threesome that I'll have. I kind of be like, I wanted to be organic, so I wanted mm -hmm. to kind of be like, I know a girl, but I want the two girls that I have it with. I already fucked them already. What do you mean by like organic, like like fruit? like like, like, like yeah, like, like FDA type B. So it's like I want them. Because some women say they'll do a threesome, but they won't eat out the other chick. Oh yes, which is like why? Why not? Yeah. So what's the point? But I also say I don't pressure, <laughs> I don't pressure women into threesomes, or I never bring it up heavily because. They might not want to eat no pussy in the same vein. I'm not gonna suck no dick if it's two niggas in the room mm -hmm. and it's a, a chick. I so you got you got to be equal with it, because a, 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 a niggas would be like, please have a threesome with me. But what if they chick be like, I want two niggas now, and the nigga gonna be like, no, if I'm cool. You don't want to have a threesome. Is she selfish? That's a bar. All right. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I asked the question. Nobody answered. Oh, you said it's oh that was a question. Was yes. Yo, I just think it's yeah, I thought I thought that was just you were just. I thought you were just laying the law. Real quick, is that is that selfish? Nah, that, that's no. not selfish. If Everybody a chick don't, I don't think so either. If she don't want to have a threesome, nah, that's yeah. not selfish at all. Yeah, I agree. Um, just real quick to add my two cents because I've had one threesome, but it was spontaneous. Oh, he, it, oh, he really cussed for real. It was yeah, it was spontaneous, okay. like how you said organic, because. Yeah. Plan like when it's so easy for me to say, "Hey, I want you, I want you to fuck me and my friend." I've had that invitation probably like three or four times, and it never happened. Right? Okay. Never. Yes. The one threesome I had was spontaneous. It just naturally happened, and then kind of like you said, I I had sex with one of them, but not the other one. Right. But when I had sex with one, she mentioned that the other one like was trying to kiss her and shit. So I'm like, mm. okay, it might actually go down, and then right. it ended up it did end up going down. Not planned or nothing. It just led to it, and was then it I, a lot. I was multitasking the whole time. Like I wanted to record yeah. it, but I couldn't. But it was. I'm gonna tell you the sexiest part. But the best part is, it was a trifecta of freakiness matched. Right. Yeah. Nobody held back. Everybody was going I like for that. it. Wilding out. Yeah. Everyone. Yeah, I like that. Yes. Which I absolutely loved. And right. my favorite part. This was crazy. Yo. So like halfway through, I'm working the whole way through. I'm right. off the henny. That's so a I'm, lot. I'm sweating. Like yeah. it's you're multitasking the whole way through. So they see I'm tired. <laughs> So it was like, sit down for a second. It's so you take a break, mid John. Yeah, yo. yeah, yeah yo. That is very sexy. Yo, se it, listen, That's sexy, sexy. Is shit, right? So I'm like, all right, bet. So I'm chilling. Damn. Shorty told the other girl, come here. They started scissoring. And I'm just watching. Whoa. I'm like, yo, is this real? I'd have, I'd have came. <laughs> I'd just be my dick in the, in the corner. Yeah, my shit would have hit the ceiling. <laughs> Bad real day. Yeah, I would have set a record. Yo, that shit was insane. But it all started from it just naturally happened. I think when people try to force the whole threesome situation, like, hey, this weekend have a threesome with me and my girl, then I don't know. It can kind of... Yeah, now, you know, now, now you like much. setting up yeah, for it. About it you much. like getting food yeah. and... Yeah, yeah. Uh, getting your uh, threesome catered. Yes. Ain't nobody in here. We fucking... Chick-fil-A catered to the yeah, house. No food in this bitch. <laughs> Absolutely. Got a piece of it. Afterwards, that'll be cool. Um, do y'all got a type? 
Oh, brother. Yes, we, we do. do. We both have a type. Well, but I mean, I don't have a type. Yeah, you do. No, I don't. Yes, you do. A lot of my shorties, they have range <laughs> and no, they, height. They have weight, range. They have range. Size. They have range. Hairstyles. They have range. So I don't really think I do have a type. Skin tone. Well, maybe I, I think I got a type. Yeah. Yeah, I got a type. What's your type? type? Braids. Locks. That's the hairstyles. All right. Those are just but it's like the it's like them like them type of Jones that just you poetic know? justice. Yeah, type beat like. Right. But that's always what be coming to me like it be women that be on their like lock journey or they braids or they twist and it's like that's my shit like. That's not a person. You did not you did I not describe a person. You described the hairstyle. That's hey, racist. So it don't so she can be white with dreads. <laughs> Thank you, yes, and, and, sir. And, and, and exactly. you were like it. That's what you're saying, right? Exactly. You like with dress and you'll go for it. Got him. Got you'll him. go for it. Brother, got you, brother. Let me break this down. Got you. So, I like my women to be like, it's crazy because like, you know, like I said, you know, niggas got range, but I do like, I've had experience with some very small women, bigger women, in between mm-hmm. women. I do like a little meat on the bones. I like, I like, yeah. I like butt. I like titties and I also like a little stump stump. It don't gotta be too crazy, but I like a the little, little teeny pouch. Yeah, you, you know, and I, and I fuck with a little arm. I fuck with a little arm. The fat. back arm. Yeah, a little back arm. A little big yeah. mama your arm. Yeah. I fuck with a little arm. I yeah. think I think women don't understand the uh, the power of a hip dip. Mm. Those are nice. Allahi, that shit. Those man. are absolutely. Those are like the little crack that be on the chicken wings. Yeah, that, those are. That's a nice addition. Yeah, I do. Absolutely. So, do y'all mind any race? It sounds like you don't. Oh, I'm black. Okay. I don't, yeah, I don't like white women. Yeah, we don't do that. I've I've had sex with a. Latino, somebody <laughs> of the Latinx community. Mm-hmm. That was fun. But, but I'm, all, I'm, all, I'm all for my people. All right. All all black have, you, have you ever slept with a white girl before? No. Okay. Yes. You? Yes. Yes. Absolutely. Yes. Yes. That's why he said, okay. Uh-huh. He said day by uh-huh. day. Why do, uh-huh. why do you need white man's paperwork? How was it? It was cool. No, it wasn't. One, it was. You didn't <laughs> like it, brother. It was like my second body was with a white girl. You came? Yeah. Wow. You came? Yeah. <laughs> it was straight. It was straight. I ain't gonna lie. Then in yeah. college, I had this one white girl. She oh, had, you just, oh, she right. you climbed the mountain. I was chilling. Yeah, yeah, I was chilling. I mean, I, I don't, me personally, I don't discriminate. I do. I shout out to you. I'm a now, as far as, as far, I'm talking about as far as dating, hooking up with, but as relationship wise and all that, yeah. that's that's different. But dating, yes. messing around, hooking up with, going around town, whatever, I don't discriminate. But it was this white girl in college, had these pretty ass blue eyes. And she was mm. pretty too. Colonizer, yes. she colonizer. She colonizer. And when she, yeah, mm. well, she colonized me because when she was chewing, <laughs> whoa, brother, when, whoa, she, when, brother. She, when she, when she, when she, yeah, she colonized the dick. When she was chewing me and looking up at me, bro. Oh yeah, I fell into that teacup from Get Out. I did, I did. I'm not gonna lie, I did. I, I was Yo. sinking. Each each stroke Look she did with her throat, I was sinking more and more. Blue eyes while you get your dick set. She was crazy. Woman. My, uh, I remember I was going to college and my sister's ex said to me like. Like you know how like when people when you go to college they drop you off your parents say something and mm-hmm. then they're supposed to like yeah. stick with you. Yeah. His last words to me was, "You get in here and you get your revenge back for your in- <laughs> for your ancestors." <laughs> hey, I fuck with that. I he said, "Get your get your get your get your lick back." He said, "I want you to fuck a white woman and you tell her who the slave now." And I was like, "Ah, I didn't obviously, of course, but what the fuck." Is that is that a thing for people? Oh shit! Said, get is that a thing? Man. I think some people do fuck with white girls just, just for like for revenge. Power dynamic. revenge. I think so. Then he said that on uh, "Don't Be a Menace." He was like, "I'm just trying to do the same thing that the white people did to our yes, ancestors for yes, hundreds yes, of years." She was like, "What's that? <laughs> fuck them! Fuck them!" <laughs> some people do. Some people do. I just can't. I don't true. know. I just something about warm uh, about brown bodies. You know, yeah, like black women yeah, look warm. I, I never imagined a white woman to have a warm pussy. It was warm. All right, so to <laughs> hey man, I just don't discriminate. That's it. That's yeah. it. That's all. I'm, I'm rocking with that though. But all right, let's go into a little bit more depth for y'all perspective of types. Okay, shall we? Mm, shall we? Because Absolutely. what we have now is a smash or pass. Let's get it. Oh, all yes. right. So we're going to ask. You know, I'm gonna lay her out, and we got to get an answer for both of y'all. So okay. this is smash or pass with Larry and Lionel. Got it. First on the list, Lizzo. Pass. Smash. Freak ball. Name 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 somebody who has smashed Lizzo. Lionel. You can't because you can't. they low key they ducked off. Lizzo just nobody seems, ever. She just seemed like she might be annoying. She oh, she's like, absolutely annoying. Are, you talking, are we going based off just looks or just like what you think about all of the period? The whole shebang. All of it. Are we doing a whole shebang personality and shit like that? Even though I don't know she, her, I'm she's a probably pass. gonna be a little annoying. But yeah. at the same time, who has fucked Lizzo? 
I'm laying that shit down. Mm, I'm laying it, it down. And I might even throw the flute in there. She played the flute, don't she? Yeah. Flute? Yeah, she do play the piccolo. She do. She played. She play one of those. Areas. She might go one of them asses where you yes, layer it down flat. The ones I like, and they spread and out. And they spread out. Mm. Yeah, it's she like got a one of those. She spreads. got a spread. Moses part to see. Uh, Absolutely, yeah, that's what I mean. respect it. All right, next, Leslie Jones. Leslie Jones. Who's Leslie Jones? She's a comedian. She's an SNL, uh, and I wouldn't. I wouldn't smash. I wouldn't smash Leslie Jones. Leslie Jones. Yeah. Oh, her? I yeah. feel like she just oh, get, no, she I'm, get I'm goofy cool in the one. she get goofy on the dick. I feel like, I feel like she, she play just, too much. Yeah, mm. she a goof. She a goofball. I I wouldn't do it. Nah, nah that's Leslie too, Jones. Have y'all ever had a chick throw y'all off because she was too goofy during sex? No, I like a, I like a little laughter during sex. Like I don't I don't want you to create no jokes, but I do think that in the the midst of something we doing so passionately and serious, it's some humor in it. Because what it's the fuck are we doing in real life? Yeah, that's a fact. You know. So all right, <clears throat> Chris Jenner. Who's that? Who Kim, 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 oh, Kim's mom. Pass. Oh, the mom? Yeah. Pass. Yeah, I'm going to say... She white, nigga. What you, why you think so? No, no, I'm, I'm going to say no, no, no. Isn't she like Armenian? Or is mm-hmm. that That's dead? white. Armenian is white. No, it's Well, not. what's considered white? Because Armenian... Not black. Do not pull my geography card for those listening. But is, Arme- is Armenia in the Middle East? Yes. Yeah. And that's not white? Yeah, what? That's not white. She's not Armenian, though, right? Yeah, I don't know where she is. Man. I know the dad was... The dad was the was the is one. You gonna smash her? Or you gonna pass her? I like short hair. She has short hair, and mm. then she got that meme with the gun. That was kind of sexy. Mm. No. I'm 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 passing, but passing? I I would consider it. It sounds like you would low key. Maybe yeah, a little, maybe, like, maybe a few a few night. few shots. I mean, of tequila. it's just something about power. She's a very powerful person. Yeah. You fucking one of the like the most powerful women ever. She probably ride crazy. I think women with power got a crazy ride game. Yeah, yeah. she's very powerful. And she and would choke she you too and, and smack like, you. But you, I, you like, know, I control the entire media. You know, she does, right? And like, she gonna call you a nigger too, mid sex. Oh, her marketing, her marketing game Immaculate. is on the beam. Yeah. Bro, I could become a millionaire after that. She, she, so. she smacks and chokes for sure. So she you would get that. Chokes. You. I You're would. asking us these questions. What's I would. Yes. Yeah, I you gotta answer some of them. Chris Jenner. You would. Chris these down. Chris Jenner. I would. I I would I would consider it. All right, no. I'm in the middle. He no would. for me. He's yeah, I would. I would. You're smashing. Probably. All right, next, Mama D. Pass. Uh, nah, she don't got enough body. <laughs> this nah. looks crazy. Mama nah, D. Is Mama, Mama D, D is your, wild. She mommy in my eye. brother. Like, honestly, brother, where's the underhand? You you keep giving yeah. us fastballs. Where's, where's, the, where's, the, where's, the, where's the where's the where's the Longs, brother? Give us an underhand. That's too what easy. The right, Longs too easy. All right, okay. I think this will warm up a little bit. Uh, Sukiana. Oh, you know what? I don't think she's really as freaky as she says she is, bro. Most I ain't even really. gonna lie. I don't really think she's cute. I'm gonna keep it a being. She got button nose. It's okay. No, she like she not ugly, but she just to me she just yeah. I don't know. It just, and the way she like, I feel like she portraying yeah, you know some shit. That yeah, she from I agree. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, she not even from yeah. out there. Yeah. So yeah. like, but yeah. also you seen that video of her sucking dick and it was ass. Mm-hmm. Yes. So I don't, yeah, I don't that's know another that thing. Yeah, I think I'm I might pass on but Sukiana only because. Sexy Reagan the park. clapped. Sexy Reagan Sexy Reagan okay. She was actually next. Pass. Yeah. So fat, f- smash. Smash. Super smash. Talk. Smash. Brothers. Hawks me. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I'm so doing all of it. Super Smash Brothers. Like yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm so passing on Sukiana. Smashing. Sexy, sexy Red. Red. Sexy. Yeah. She got to say it was due to ad libs. Sexy. Oh, tell sexy. her to say her ad libs while you smashing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 I think I think Sexy Red is cute for real. She is. I think she is. Like, cause you see, I've seen videos with her, like no makeup and shit. Her just chilling. She cute. She is. And she really she really who she is. I like women that's really like authentically who they are. They're not Facts. trying to be nobody. Yeah. yeah you you can tell that that's she's a hood real. bitch for real. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. You know? Mm-hmm. I'm gonna smash her as well. All right, next, Missy Elliott. Smash. Smash. She but not even this Missy Elliott. The early nineties. Work Missy it, Missy Elliott. Elliott. Well, I I'm thought she was like a super little lesbian fly. a little bit. Super yeah. duper fly. She trash did. bag. I'm uh, trash, yeah, I'm hitting the trash bag. Yeah. I'm hitting with the trash bag on. Super duper. It's, fly. It should be a hole in the trash bag. It's gonna get sweaty. I feel like Missy. I feel like Missy a freak, freak. Like she a really a freak bitch. You remember when uh, the the music video where somebody like spit in her mouth? Spit in yeah. your mouth. Yeah. That didn't turn nobody on a little bit. No. I was like six okay. or seven. I, I got it got me going yeah. at, the, at that young age. I was like, whoa, young yeah. boy. Yeah, I was there a little bit. It got me. I'm not all the way on, but I was halfway on. I yeah, was like, oh, yeah. where do we do this at? But I think she spit in the nigga mouth. And then that's when I was like, eh. Yeah, she spit yeah. in his mouth. He might have spit it back at her. I don't know. Are you on? Well, spit off? well, since we're here, let's get y'all with that. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. So I, I, you, up, go ahead. I love So I love how, you know, in a sexual kingdom, you get to like grow. Because I mm-hmm. was against 
get my mouth spat in like two years ago. Mm-hmm. And now that's something that turned me on. Like I like to okay. lay back and I look at tell, tell her look me in my eyes mm-hmm. and be like spit in my mouth, open up, and it's just you know. But I've been I I've been doing the spitting mostly because that's what women request. Like you'll spit yeah. in my mouth. Yeah. Some women like when you hold it open, you just keep on spitting. Um, I've keep on spitting. Like he spit. I've encountered a story or two that like they face spit on, like just spit on me. You know, like uh, spit all over their body, like shit like that. Yeah. She got some trauma. No, and we all do. <laughs> We all do. Yeah, we, yeah, all yeah, do. Yeah, we all do. We yeah, all do. Yeah, facts. We facts. All do. Got some I do. But I like that too, though. The straight spit. What do you mean? Like, she, you just going loogie after loogie in her no mouth? No loogies. No, we not loogies. Well, I'm just, you know, I'm, I yeah, don't no, know. Like just, spit wide. So you just, I'm so saying, I'm just yeah. holding, holding her mouth open. I'm just huh. spitting every once in a while. I just okay. keep on spitting. It's not like a one. Okay. It ain't a one spit shot. Yeah. But I also like to get spit on, too. Like, not my face, but I do like. Oh, shorty spit in your mouth. Yeah, like my mouth, like, spit around and spit around before you suck it, spit on the. Yeah. But like a far away John, like take it from Carrie Ranch. What if y'all had Chipotle earlier? Nope. She spit yeah. in your mouth and a bean. We, a did bean, we just talk about this? A bean yeah, was in no, it. I had the bean so. was in it. Maybe we just talking about the it surety just ate some bullshit and yeah. she tried to suck your dick. Yes. And, you know, we not oh, sweet. that's the yes. difference? We got to clear out first. We got to. I got to. she give you head? What's. I yeah, it is just some head, bullshit. Huh? Yeah. Mm. Nah. You can't eat no hoagie and then come suck my dick. Why yeah, not? that's a little crazy. <laughs> like, yeah, no, you can't you, eat like an entire <laughs> fucking sandwich, like a, a gross sandwich at that. Like, Are y'all worried about the smell or her putting it on your dick? Both of them. Smell is a little eat crazy. Eat a granola bar before you suck some dick. Don't eat no crazy. That's crazy. Don't get no don't eat no, food Also, don't granola. eat no granola bar. That's a lot of crumbs. That's a lot of stuff, yeah. yeah. That's a lot of crumbs. Just come blank. That old t- <laughs> come blank. Yeah, with a clean come fruit. With a clean yeah. slate. Fruit. Yeah, yeah, clean slate. I like, I like fruit. Fruit yeah, is pretty good. Clean slate fruit. She gonna be spitting up. We some picky motherfuckers. Ain't yeah, we? Look yeah. at us. Who, Meanwhile, we, 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 are. we don't give a fuck what they come through with to keep it a bean. <laughs> I don't, don't let care me know what you just ate. I don't care at all. Uh, are y'all chubby chasers? I think yeah. I'm be. I think I, I'll be chubby chased. I think I might be. The, you are the. What you say? You be, attract them naturally. I think that. I think that once I found out my ex was a chubby chaser, I started. I, I laughed about it because I'm like, oh, you like fat niggas. Mm-hmm. I feel like women have gotten to the range of like really getting into fat niggas. Mm-hmm. But I don't think I'm a chubby chaser. I think that I do like a little chubster, but yeah. I take. I like. I look at a face first on some no bullshit because mm-hmm. I gotta look at you, mm-hmm. you know, often. I gotta bring you around my people. Yeah, and, you know, and like people, people try to act like that's not a thing, but like I want my women to be, you know, pretty in the face. I bring around my people. It's like, yo. You want, you want your people to compliment yeah. and be like, okay, I see you, Neff. Yeah. That's the highest about. form of compliment as far as bringing your shorty through. Yes. Your uncle hit you with that. Yes. I see you, Neff. I see you, Neff. It's like, damn, yeah. I got a stamp. You're like, I mean, yeah, you know, very come true. on, you already know what it is, man. Yeah, hope the whole time he ain't even know. Yeah, yeah right, right, right. Like, so, <laughs> yeah, oh, right. <laughs> so, so how does he how does he tell you? Like, how does he tell if you? If she ain't official? Yeah. Do we do anything? He don't say nothing. He don't say nothing. Now that we are becoming the uncles, are you going to say something to Absolutely. You want to keep it a G? They got to be grown, though. Like, yeah. I'm just saying, like, now you grown. are, you. we are the OGs now. We're yeah. turning into that. If my young boy come around, he 20, 22, I'm like, he brings something around. I'm like, okay, Kyle, okay. Yeah, yeah, but what yeah, if it's Kyle, not like well, that? Are you going to tell him? Other side. I'm just like, nice to meet you. You know what I'm <laughs> That's saying? That's like, crazy. You know, like, <laughs> yeah. you can't, because you're not, you know, yeah, like, I'm not cold hearted, but you gotta fuck, tell my nephew that's the you gonna fuck up his, you gonna fuck up his self esteem, his confidence. But I mean, you can tell him without being harsh. I think yeah. you can do, you can do you better. Can, no, 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 you can do better you than that. Yeah. Be like, yo, what happened? Oh, what happened to the last joint? That's crazy. Ah! In the face of the new joint? Nah, crazy. nah, nah, not in her face. Nah, not in her face. Nah, nah, nah. Just pull on the side. Be like, okay, you gotta wait till she off. Yeah, yeah. Be like, okay, nephew. Say hi to everybody else. Aunt that be asking is this the same girl? Oh. Like from all my life, no oh, matter what you oh, bring around. in person. Yeah, oh, she my, just. I'll be like, oh, she she just this, doing um, that to test the water. Same, this this the same girl. I'm like, yo, yeah or yeah or no. In front of her like, face. Yeah, nigga. Like oh, that's she crazy. just doing that to be petty. Yeah, yeah, she like, is. yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't see that. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, older people could get away with a lot of shit. Yo, people I'm, I'm trying to be like fuck. that. I don't care. Like, what's, yeah, I'm, I'm trying to be like that. Wait, I was thinking about um, real quick, real quick to go back to that spitting topic. Have y'all ever missed the mark? You spit in shorty's mouth. I've only done it like twice. You ever missed the mark? Nah, I never have. I, I missed, missed the, the mark. mark before on spin on some pussy from high, trying to be cute with it. Yeah, you So, like, say, I put yeah. my dick on the clitoris, right? And mm-hmm. I try to spit down, let it drip, mm-hmm. and then just splash the situation. Mm-hmm. Even though it's already wet, you splash it a little mm-hmm. bit. Yeah. I done missed on some funny shit and laughed in my head, like, damn, I'm far off. You know what you what gotta you do? do? Yeah, I, I spit just on a butthole. On the floor. Yeah. Spit on a butthole, let it drip down. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Spit on a butthole, dab it. I'm talking about missionary. 
Mm. Like I like I spit. Okay, missionary, you pull out, you spit down. Yeah, like oh, I, sorry, I sit yeah. the dick on the, you mean, and then I just spit down. What did it hit? Like the bed? No, it went between us both, uh -huh. and it just hit. either hit the floor of the bed. Yeah, yeah, yeah I've had yeah, that yeah, before. Yeah, yeah, I don't think anyone's happen. ten for ten on this. You know, spit down. Game. Then you dehydrated, so I ain't got no more spit. Yeah, so, like, we yeah, so it don't come that out. That was the one, smooth. huh? You yeah, had one, one bullet, and one you missed. Same real red. Yeah, yeah. What's the heaviest y'all have ever hit? Oh, that's a good question. I fucked with a weight was. Yeah. Let's say biggest weight and height, just overall uh, circumference. Ah, shout out to this young woman, yeah. uh, um, because I appreciate you. I know we fell out of getting up yeah, yeah, yeah. but um, it was a joint I was I was rocking with, and she was a basketball player. Mm. And, and it, it, I, I rock with a couple like two, three basketball players because mm -hmm. I'm trying to make this general. At some point in time, right? Have you? Yeah. Um, yeah. Well, Go ahead, say some names, brother. <laughs> um, so I was I was rocking with this uh John. She played ball. She was she was probably my height, no bullshit. But she wasn't big. She was stacked. And what's she, your height? Yeah, I'm five eleven. So okay. She's probably like five ten, five eleven. Uh -huh. But she uh she was stacked. So if she was shorter, mm -hmm. she would have been bigger. Yeah. But she mm -hmm. still had that like athletic, yeah, like shape. What but I could like tell two. Okay, five ten. What like two fifty? Not two fifty quite, but her all her shit was here. Okay, but all if she here. but if she is tall, right? Height height is weight. She, she might have been. What I'm saying, I'm thinking she because women be weird with their weight. They may be like one eighty and look like two. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but different. see, I think she might have been two. She might have been two thirty five, two four, two thirty five. Yeah, that's two fifty. Yeah. But I fuck. Yeah, something. literally proving you know what? Point. But you know what? I I fuck something bigger than that. So I'm I'm, I'm trying to think. While he's thinking, what's yours? Yeah, I'm um, trying to think. You know, height wise, it was was probably um five nine. My ex, the hairdresser. Yes, yes, she's she like five, she was like eight, five nine, nine five ten, five eight. eight. Um, but she wasn't like really big. Though. Like she wasn't big. No, weight wise, yeah, big, big. Definitely like, was like on some like two. I want to say like maybe two forty. This is a hard question though. Yeah, because I, I don't some big John, but I don't know. I don't know how they. Work I don't. Right. I don't. It's, 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 it's a okay. guesstimate. It's yeah, a guesstimate. So I'm gonna probably say like two forty. I'm gonna go to two forty for sure. You're three hundred. Nah, That's three. I don't know. Okay. Three, three hundo. I, I ain't never well, I touched. Three. I ain't yeah, never touched the three. Yeah. But she, but she lost all this weight. Like, like she was working hard throughout the years. Before or after you had it? She dropped. She was like, oh, I don't know who that is. She had to. You would, yeah, but you never showed oh, me right, before. But, but she was, she was bigger shaped, but she was like she had a shape, but she was bigger. She had lost all this weight. Oh. But she, when I was cracking her way back, she was like probably like two seventy, two seventy five. Yeah, yeah. I was trying to lift it too bad. I was, yeah. you was trying to lift her. I was up. trying to lift it, bro. Mm. I was getting there though. I was, you, so was I was her shit up. You, you, only get, you only get it for a couple of seconds, <laughs> bro. It's a couple of seconds. I, I, I am not. Big. Uh, yeah, yeah. I wouldn't even attempt. I've never even. Are we losing? To. Are, are y'all losing your touch uh, in the bedroom? Do you do you feel it a little bit? As far as like what lifting overall, like lifting shorties, trying to do all of that magical shit. Do y'all? Nah. Do y'all? Are you still heavy? You think it depends I, on I, like the size. Yeah, it I feel on, it. it depends on her. I, and if I'm, you know, I'm not gonna do that with just everybody. Yeah, I, I, I fucked the yeah. joint that was like 90, 95 pounds, one hundred one hundred ten. What? And oh that's, yeah, that's, that's the right. ones you could pick up all night oh, you and do whatever the fuck you want. You fuck them in doggy by lifting them yeah, off your yeah, body and yeah, oh yeah, 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 like just yeah, really get to yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. So you know it depends, but you know I'm getting older, a little slower with the sex. I'm taking my time a lot more, not slower as far as like more stroking, sensual. Just, yeah, just a little more more sensual, sensual you know. Yeah. Um, just to answer the heaviest I hit. She might have been just under 300. I'm not going to lie. I done hit a few. Yeah. My uncle always told me growing up, if you don't hit a few BB dubs, you ain't a real dude. So <laughs> I agree with that. Yeah. I, I, I hit a few, but it was one in particular. This was, for those, for those who want to me going to know who I'm talking about, this was, she was big and tall. Oh, shit. Yeah. Her nickname was. That's not Oh, nice. they really know who you're talking about Yeah, because <laughs> I'm, I'm going to block out the but pause. But me, uh, she, 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 <laughs> take a picture of the time stamp for you. Nah, nah, nah. I'm, I'm a, when I listen back, I'm going to do it. But uh, He listens to the Yeah, I do all this shit manually, bro. I don't use AI brother. when I edit this me shit, either. bro. bro. Yeah, I take, if, I, if I bleep something, I just take a pic, and then I know where exactly what to do. That go. is smart, though. Yeah, that yeah. is smart. But she's big and tall, bro. So 
Shorty, I still remember it vividly because it was dark. We was in my room. I have a queen size. What's what's bigger, queen or king? King, king. is bigger than the okay. Queen. I have a queen size bed, right? Still yeah. And she, yeah, it's a big ass bed. And I just, I still vividly remember it, the silhouette of her bent over on my bed. Yes, sir. And taking up like three quarters of my fucking yes, bed. Yes, sir. Just That's a- yeah. And you know the craziest part though, as big as she was, she got me out of there quick. That's so, nice with it. Nice with it. She was nice. Quick. So yeah. you, all that, that shit. That, shit. that, that shit, shit was gushy. Shit. Got out of there. That's that shit, though. Quick. That shit ain't really like a like a uh, specific to any size and shit. It depends on the chick. Like, some mm-hmm. chicks really got that grab. Like, mm-hmm. I remember the first mm-hmm. time I experienced that pussy grab when I put a shorty in collapsed doggy. I call it grounded pound. Okay. When I experienced the grab, I said, oh, they, it's certain women that know how to squeeze their pussy. Yeah. They, yeah. When they, when they, when they the want kegel. that nut. Yeah, when they, when they want that nut out of you, they kegel that shit out. That's a good kegel. Yeah, man. I like, I some like do that. that. Some do that when they have an orgasm. Um, yeah. Jamaicans call it squinting. Yeah. Oh, I like that. Yeah. Shout out to my Jamaicans. Jamaicans. No, oh. but my freshman year in college, I dealt with this Jamaican shorty from Brooklyn for about a good year. Yeah. She turned me out. They'll do that. Good Lord, yeah. she turned yeah, me out. Yeah, yeah she was that. like, you ever had a girl squint? I'm like, nah. She got on top and did that shit, bro. I lost my start. fucking mind. Yeah. I like I that. I got five me in Jamaica. I, ain't I, was, I, was, I was stuck in her ever, ever since. I, I ain't looking her up. So you ever do that like an old joint? Like you just be thinking about it. You be like, damn, let me see if I can find her on IG or something. And you type in some shit to try to find her and there's nothing. So oh, I go to Facebook. yeah, I've done that. Yeah. I might go to I've Facebook. I've done that before. Facebook yeah. definitely has it. I couldn't find nothing on it. Not a thing. It yeah, I've I've definitely I've done it before. Mm-hmm. Um have you ever have you ever seen a shirty that you fuck with in a in a porno? That's crazy. Like a real life porno? Not a real life porno, like, but only you fa- see, like Twitter, like yeah, only Twitter fans porn type shit. Yeah, I remember one time I was scrolling on uh Twitter porn because that's my that's my shit. It's the go to that's my go to. And the shorty that I was fucking with, I seen her in a video. Yeah. Getting clapped up. Do I continue to do I, Yeah, do I Absolutely. masturbate? <laughs> Absolutely. You know why? Because you, you, you question. Do that. I do I that? Do my, yeah. I think it's more personal. I think yes, because you you know how that you personally know how that felt. Yeah. That's why I like my news and my my videos and shit. I like to I like it to be familiar faces like. I still be my dick to some of my old sex tapes because it's like so you do that. I was there. I earned this video. You feel what I'm saying? How about you, Lionel? Uh, to answer the question, yes, I have. A, I did be my dick to her video, and also, oh, to answer and question. also, I was. I think any. I think any yeah. sane person would have did it, yeah. right? If, yeah. if we had real good sex, I would be my dick to your picture. It could just be a picture oh, of your crazy. ass. And I'm like, I, <laughs> I get remember. Because you remember, bro. I, I, my I get body it. is it'll remember do, how you something. smell, how you look, how you felt. I get that. All I need is the, the visual. You feel I get me? that. I it get that. Fun. I do like that. Blast off type beat. So I had a young lady tell me that it's petty for dudes to keep pictures and videos like news or sex tapes after y'all stop messing with each other. Why would I? Why would I be petty? Um, I, earned, I earned it. Yeah. I don't know. I'm kind of on the fence with it. You don't I think so? Because what if you, what if, what if you go through, what if your shorty got her old sex tape? Yeah, that's old videos, old videos of uh, niggas. Fuck. Not even it being leaked. Because I told her I'm not, not going to leak it. Like we're not, if we're my, not animals. If my, yeah, if my no. girl got sex tapes and shit, and her phone, or her getting clapped or something like that, and that's my chick. First off, I'm not going to know. Right. Second of all, that that ain't really my business. Yeah, and like yeah, that, that's a video you had. Like you. Mm-hmm. You know, like so. The, her question was, "What's the point?" So let me ask y'all: Why keep old pictures and sex videos from someone you used to deal with? I don't just keep them. I just don't delete them. It's not like I'm. So I'm you keep them. So you keep them. <laughs> <laughs> this about? is literally you gotta rephrase, bro. Brother, me. It's about the words. You know what I'm saying, All bro? Right. <laughs> but no, so because I, I still go back to some of my archives and, and use it. Like I, you beat your dick to it. Yeah. Yeah. No, I'll yeah. definitely beat my dick to it. Like I yeah. earned that video. Yeah, I think that's what you're saying. So yeah, I, I, I think, um, like I said, you know, we getting older. You want to go back to your glory days sometimes? Like, yeah. I'm not all the way old, but I'm just saying, like, niggas was niggas had some motion. Yeah, like, you know, I had some shit going on. And I told her I see it as like a complimentary value. Like, I'd be like, damn, yo, shorty was really nice. Like, you yeah. remember this? Be like, damn, she sexy. Especially that shit was like that. Damn, that shit was that was a good ass fucking time. Yeah, and ain't, especially and, when you get the doggy though, right? When you when you when you hit it from the back and you can record. And that's my problem. I can't record long and doggy 
Cause I'm a nut, you feel what I'm saying? So I'm, all my dogs, well, I'm looking at the screen. Cause I'm looking at two butts now. Uh, <laughs> they feel good, but also I'm looking at the real ass and the, the camera ass on the camera. It's a different it, perspective. And I'm like, look, Ooh. all my all my best shot videos that I recorded is less than like a minute. Cause I put the <laughs> so, phone down. I don't yeah, even know. Yeah, yeah, okay. I put the phone down because okay. I'm trying yeah. to fuck. Yeah, I ain't. You know what I'm saying so. I put the phone down. That's crazy. With the dog, dog. <laughs> no, I, I put like the it. phone down and I just rock out. You feel what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> that shit, that shit is pointing right at you. Um, <laughs> get the dog. I'm gonna get back to the subject real quick. That's actually a good thing though that she's doing that because that's a high sign of trust and respect. Oh, she's chilling. Yeah. Oh, oh, with absolutely. Y'all. oh we If know, a yeah. dog, if a dog shows their stomach, then that means they really trust who they're around because that's their most vulnerable part said, of their oh, you body. You just fucked it up. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. yeah. that's no, their I, most vulnerable yeah. part of their body. So for her doing that. You know, and her just chilling. That's a that's a good sign of trust amongst y'all. Y'all got good energy. Yeah. If a chick came to my crib and like Desi didn't fuck with her, she gotta go. Yeah, really. Real talk. I've had Real one shit. chick that like Desi was kind of iffy about, and she was kind of acting a little funny towards Des. It didn't it didn't last long at all. And like hindsight, I see why. Like her yeah. energy was fucked. Yeah, I went to some girl crib, and her cat kept fucking with me. I was the bad energy that day or something. Yeah, I don't her cat was hissing at me. Yeah, oh, I was hissing at it you. Was hissing. Like, but cats but that's a good. That's good to have a dog that can actually kind of tell you what's going on. Oh yeah, like that's kind of fire. Oh yeah, I dogs never sense about energy. That. That's they, sense, yeah. they sense your mood. Like they can tell how, how your mood is off of you know the shit we release based off of the moods we're on. All you niggas out there with them big ass dogs with no leash walking up the street, stop saying that the dog nice. Put your fucking dog on a leash. Yeah, they do be like, oh, he doesn't bite. I don't care. What are you talking about? Get him on a leash. Big ass cane corso. I don't know. He, he could be him. having a bad day. I see that about people when I'm having a bad day. Rottweiler. What the fuck? Rottweilers, Kane Corsos. Be like, nah, he chilling, bro. He don't bite. And listen, that. they be cool dogs, but don't, because I could be, what if I start running? Yeah. He's going to chase you. He gonna, that's what I'm saying. 100%. So don't do that. Yeah. Don't run, nigga. I'm running. Do they do that with, like, when you have your dog and you're walking your dog and people have their dog? Do you? Do, yeah, do you yeah because, well, first off, I would admit that I do be having her without a leash sometimes. <gasps> Come on, you one of them niggas? Yeah, Whoa, I, am. I ain't even brother. gonna hold you. But she, it's just because I know I know my dog. But if I'm around a lot of people, if we're walking somewhere public, no. But like how she was outside yeah, earlier, yeah, she yeah, chilling. She if I'm walking chilling. down the street and I know it's nobody there, then I know what type of dog I got. But she looks intimidating. So yeah. people already like see her and get this preconceived notion that she's like a, you know, aggressive dog. Yeah, that dog is all, that's all far news. From. Yeah, all, and muscle too. It's crazy because yeah. I don't really fuck with people with dogs, but when I walked in, I was like, oh, this dog chilling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She, yeah she's very, energy. very that's chill. How, that's how I get, you know, like into shit. Like if, you know, like, you know, I fuck with elevators, right? Yeah, you don't. So if I, I walk into some shit on some calm shit, I'm like, all right, everybody chilling. I'm going to just shut the fuck up. I'm going to think in my head. I'm scared as fuck. You mean? But like when I got like y'all and them had a dog, my friends. Before I got to the King Corso, they was hyping it up. Oh, like, yo, don't even worry about it. She chilling. And I'm just like, why y'all keep talking about it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. But if yeah, I just yeah. let it happen, yeah. if, I walked in happen room, naturally. if I walked in a room and the dog just came to me, I'm like, okay. Right. Cool dog. Okay. So, yeah, you know, yeah, I gotta yeah, just yeah. walk into That's shit. That's very true. If you would have said I got a dog, I would have been thinking about it like, yeah. oh, you got a dog. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you don't fuck with elevators, so at Sky House, going to the 22nd. Oh, I'm going to get on it, yeah. Okay. It's just... Because <laughs> yeah. the hose around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I got to get, but, but it's just... <laughs> get on shit. The hose around. <laughs> I can't look like no, no, no bitch in front of the hose. <laughs> no, I ain't like, no none of that go, it, It'll go like... Because th- places like that take care of their stat, they shit. So, like, I tell people, I'll get on the elevators at a hospital alone mm-hmm. because I know that if something go down, they go... They, they got an infrastructure it's, at least coming in. They're yeah. like, no, even they put patients on them elevators. Yeah. So it's like yeah. they got a mechanism. Yeah. But if I'm in the fucking projects, yeah. Or if I'm in some yeah. random ass, like, you know? Yeah. Like I'm like, y'all take care of this shit. Since you said since the hoes around, what are some of the Weirdest things do. Let me tell you what Lionel does. You Hold on, you didn't even. Okay, let him okay, finish. Okay. He knows. All right, well, let me let properly lay it out. Let him what let are, what are some thing. of the weirdest things dudes do? Got when they it. get around home. Perfect. So play Meek Mill. So, play so, Meek Mill. So, B sides. No, 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 no. Play the worst Meek Mill song worse? ever. What's worse? You don't got to make songs. What's worse? Play the worst, worst right? Meek Mill song. Play it out. Play it out. <laughs> play Meek Mill in front of the hoes, right? No, no, no. But it, you got to oh, no, 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 no. let me lay it out. Go ahead, though. Play Meek Mill for the hoes, right? Yeah. Or tell your mans, yo, you got something on your shirt. Up the middle. Yeah. That's funny. Talk to me, Dave. The hoes like laughing. What's worse? What's worse? Well, did they laugh? They if nobody, nobody was around. Nobody, nobody was, was around. around. They, it was, was around. they was listen. We was at a painting sit. Right. Uh-huh. Lur, Lur threw it. Lur got through more of them joints. Yeah, I do. I Lur, Lur, Lur hosted a painting sit. Right. 
in no, the hose. Smoke, smoking sip. It was no. a smoking yeah. sip. Okay. It was a smoking sip. And the hose was was uh no, it was a smoking paint. Puffing paint. We okay. It was a puffing paint. I was gonna say Sorry. smoking Sorry. sip is just a kickback. It's crazy. Niggas <laughs> 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 yeah. so just getting high in the room. <laughs> yeah, that's just a kickback. High drunk. Yeah, it was a party. <laughs> just going out a party. It's just a party. Yeah. yeah. No, it yeah. was a puffing paint. Okay. And the hose was painting. It was right. the painting section. Nobody was looking. How you know nobody was looking? I went like this, bro. You got something on your shirt. And then I went, bloop. It was downtown. Damn, I wear glasses. Nobody was around. If if it was hoes around, what I had did it? Yes. Absolutely. Yes, he was. But yeah. it, nobody was around, and I still did it. I don't care. But what's worse? It's funny though. It's, it's fun. not funny. The hoes that, gonna laugh. Oh my god, they so that's, stupid. That's that's worse. Like, they so that's, stupid. That's, that's worse. Did that's you not? Did he knock your glasses loose? Is that? Yes. No, I didn't. No, I, I did. You go on my face with fucking glasses, or it's gonna do like this. <laughs> it's just it's just a little brute. Like like that's not nothing crazy. Bro, it's okay. You yeah. had a silly moment. I had a silly had a moment. moment. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's, that's but song. also, Lionel tried to. I tried to. I tried to shadow box this nigga, slap slap box in front of the hoes. Like, my now, see, that's absolutely worse. That's that's, crazy. that's the worst yeah. one. That's, that's the worst one. A nigga start going like this. That's the worst what are you one. Doing? That's in front of the hoes. That, see, I was ready to say that's number one. When you try to fight or like shadow box or slap box, whatever, in front of the hoes, that's absolutely the worst. Or if you one. tell your man take what my if, shoes off. Yeah. All right. Yeah. What if you borrowing your man's shit? And then he that's, go like, bro, that's my hat in front yeah, of the hood. Is that crazy, you, bro? That's, like, that, man, might bro not that's be a, that might not be a man. That's for real. That's yeah, that's, that's, that's crazy. crazy. Can I just lay out what he did real yeah, quick? All right, so he was at a party, right? Mm-hmm. Meek Mill is not bad. Go ahead, though. It's insane, bro. It's insane, bro. It's, <laughs> go ahead. It's, go it's go a little ahead, crazy. Go ahead, go ahead. All right, so we was there. <clears throat> it was like three, four shorties in the in the crib. Mm-hmm. We kind of getting ready for the kickback to begin. We get there. Shorties, you mean, they like, um... Well, first of all, a girl goes, "You smell, you smell nice," mm. and he says, "What I'm supposed to stink? That's crazy. That's, that's not that's, that's my, that was <laughs> that you just loaded yourself up for for bad vibes." So then she goes, that's "Okay." My anxiety, yo. So then she goes, mm, "Okay." So then she goes, "Play some music." He goes, "All right, you yeah. think you gonna play some Meg Thee Stallion, Cardi B, nope. something fly? Nope. Nope. You mean get the hoes going? We want them to. We're at a party. Oh, we're, getting, we're getting the vibes going. This nigga plays Meek Mill B sides. It wasn't even like it was like shining <laughs> no, like a lamp. No, it was shining like a lamp. I'm gonna shine like a lamp. I'm like, bro, what the fuck are you doing, bro? We oh shit." <laughs> Bro, Philly, bro, that's insane, bro. Oh, you could have played man. anything in the world, bro. Oh, shit. How did, how did, the they, how did, they, re, how did they react no, to actually, me? A nigga, a nigga came off. up and was like, hey, bro, you got <laughs> You got <laughs> turned. we didn't know. A nigga we did not know was like. I ain't know that nigga. Bro was like, bro, you can't play Meek Mill. Yeah, the, bitches, the niggas bro. came in the in the crib and was like, oh, y'all niggas playing Meek Mill. All right. <laughs> he said, bro, you going to change this. But we keep it a B, right? Oh, that's true. Them bitches wasn't nothing to be mean about. Oh, I mean, I mean they was in, it don't matter. They it was in your matter. vicinity. It Y'all was matter. hosting them. It's practice at that point. I put, Shorty complimented you. I will do it again. You kind of yeah, trauma you, dump. No, 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 no. Yeah, no, that, that was crazy, crazy, bro. That was yeah, crazy. that was. I'm supposed but to think it's crazy. Uh, you know how, like, you, you, uh, usually I'm good on my feet. I'm good on my toe. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. She caught me off guard. I, I was a little anxious. I said, you know, I said some jokes. I said some. I said some jokes. Give you a compliment. She caught me off guard. Cause that's when we straight walked in, but ever since dinner I've been prepared for that one. You have, I you have, have man. I've been good with that. Okay, so what do you hit a shorty with now when she you compliments smell your smell? Yeah, I say I appreciate. I say I appreciate it. Thank okay, you. Yeah, and if exactly. she smells good, which they sometimes do, usually do, mm-hmm. I'd be like, that, "You smell good too. What you got on?" And yeah, you go from there. That's Stay nice. Back. That's nice. Yeah. Wow. That's my favorite compliment. <laughs> oh shit. Um, but yeah, definitely. If I had to judge hierarchy, whose was worse? The absolute worst. I don't think either one of y'all said is that my hat or those my shoes. That's, yeah, that's, that's crazy. That's but crazy. But shadow boxing that takes the cake. That's number Sh- one. Shadow boxing is wild. Yeah, that's have number you, one. Have you ever done anything like that in front of the chicks? Nah, bro. I've never done you it. You've never done crazy to your means in front of the hook. Like, uh, you mean we all got our moments, our little. I, 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 well, I, I threw up. I threw up. Oh, that's crazy. Moments. See, that's yeah. worse than all of this. That's insane, bro. But I can't control that. Y'all, can, you could control doing a joke. You could control you what music you, you play. I couldn't control it. You it know what I'm saying? Controlled. It is what it is. I couldn't control it. Luckily, one of the shorties I already hooked up with, so like it wasn't like you know the biggest turn off in the world. But yeah, yeah, yeah. those were crazy times. Y'all ever been turned off by a chick that threw up around y'all? Mm-hmm. Would that would that turn you off? You talking about women that I'm fucking with? Like, like yeah. we going home together? Say you y'all ain't do nothing yet, but you trying to hook up with her. What's up? Oh, matter of uh, fact, let's okay. be twisted. You ain't hook. Okay. You ain't you ain't hook up with her yet, but you trying to. You filling her out. Mm-hmm. What are some things a young lady could do to turn you off? Well, to to for personally, I haven't experienced uh, a woman throwing up like before we like bought the link or we bought. You know what I'm saying? So 
they usually kind of hold that. Like, and all the women that threw up around me, we was in relationships. Okay. So, like, they got turned. I picked them up from somewhere. They yeah. was too turned. They threw up. Yeah. I, you know? But That's some good. shit that could, some shit that could really, uh, why is that you calling me? My fault. That can really turn me off is you not having a sense of humor. That's really important. And also, yeah. I judge women based around if I could bring you around my friends and how you mesh. And I've experienced the ex, you know, in a you know, an ex or two that I would bring around and they just don't mesh. And I remember one specific ex, the one I always talk about. And my friends was telling me, like, yo, we don't fuck with her. Like she Do you miss her? Sorry, no. Man, I'm she actually lived here. In Charlotte? Yeah, Charlotte. But um, <clears throat> I, I was just telling like my one of my man's like my my man Yacht was like bro she kind like she and he nice he a nice nigga like mm-hmm. I was just like yeah if you can't my niggas feel like you weird they cool so mm-hmm. it was like you got to be on some weird shit and so I hindsight at that moment did you kind of be like ah y'all might be tripping a little and kind of stay with her like, or did y'all take yeah. their word yeah when you got a surety I think you you just go with whatever she say because she she's providing the pussy and the whole thing I was yeah. in love so in the yeah. moment you okay yeah. you're but, like, in, in yeah, a way my mom was saying it too to, to answer to answer the question um about like turn offs before it even mm-hmm. get yeah. there I think being too drunk could be a thing. Mm-hmm. Like, so cause, sure. cause then it's like, damn, is this you when you lit? Yeah, like, you just start yeah, doing time. that, and then you know she like acting crazy. Yeah. Especially if you like go on a date, you get what I'm saying. Like, yeah. if you if you Slapping going on a delivery. date with her, yeah. And now like, she, like you gotta take care of her now a yeah, little bit. Yeah, like, facts, you can't facts. just up and leave her. Yeah. Y'all going on a date together? That's a little crazy. Yeah. So I, I think like getting too drunk is definitely um a turn off. Like, yeah, too, I too think drunk? so too. Damn. Do y'all trip if I, we forgot to mention this one? When a dude becomes a comedian, when you bring a shorty around? Oh, oh shit! Yes, that's a, yeah. That's especially a like one. a personal joint. You have a personal joint, and you like your dude all of a sudden are like the funniest niggas on earth. Yeah, he, he, he on his Kevin Hart. Yeah, yeah like bro, why are you shit. telling these jokes? Yeah. These aren't even. This is yeah. crazy. This isn't yeah. even you. Yeah. But do you let him rock? Rock? Cause like he right, he cooking. Ah, see the thing about me, I will get awkward, so I will I will move this from the situation. So if somebody's like hourly being loud and trying to like get their jokes off above the conversation, uh-huh. I will walk away. Okay. You know, if I'm, with a John, no, if I'm if I'm with a little John I rap with, I'm gonna pull her to the side. Okay. But if I'm if it's I'm just, just somewhere quiet, this is yeah, yeah you're gonna too, play it all loud in here. They'll be like, hey, let's da 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 da. Yeah, what let's dip on. What, are you, what y'all doing? Where y'all going at? Yeah. But anyway, but listen, check this out. Tell me why da da da, and he keeps going. That is yeah. Wild. He, he run his fucking mouth. Then you would just have to break the ice. Like, yo, we'll be back. Yeah, right. I think um if if my if my niggas is, is going crazy, we it's been times where like like remember that time uh what's his name Blur? What are you doing? Uh, Marquis, I'm a I'm a you basketball coach and Marquise keep calling me, okay. so I don't know if he had like an emergency or something. My fault. All right. Whatever. Um, but no, remember we, when we was with those white people and what's his name? He was on the trucks. No, oh. no, 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 with Twine. Oh, and he my turned boy, into an entire. Th- th- we wasn't around the shorties. Mm-hmm. Thank God, it but was, he like he like crazy. turned into an entire comedian, yeah. and we was just like, bro, when when did you start acting like this? Yeah. Like it was so. But his comedy, his comedy style works for white people. Oh, yeah, it does. Like it does. so, he was doing it around the white people. Yeah, yeah, he was around. Like, he was killing. Oh, yeah, man. he was cooking. He was cooking. But my guy, Tyrone, you're hilarious. Yeah, <laughs> like it was Tyrone. like <laughs> <laughs> it was like that. Like they was okay. just like, yo, this guy's. Yeah, this guy's yeah, fucking yeah, hilarious. Yeah, he's, he's just like, yeah. I'm just like, <laughs> I'm just like, bro, what is happening? Like, this is a whole other way in a black room. I'm yeah, okay, okay, no. Okay. So yeah. if it was like that, like if if my man is just on fire in front of the hoes, I I'll be like, all right, like I guess you gotta so let who, him rock. Who huh? are you giving a side eye to? If you have a personal joint and your man's just cracking crazy jokes out of nowhere, and she a key key, and she laughing. You giving a side eye to her? Yeah, to her or him? Who you giving a side eye to? Oh, then what's shit. she laughing at them corny ass jokes for? That she out of it. Yeah, it's, it might be her, huh? Yeah, I might, have, I might just she have to probably. be like, yo, you. Were... That's kind of crazy. Funny. Yeah. We back at the crib. She like washing her face. I'm like, you was laughing, kind of. <laughs> yeah, you was like, laughing a little. You mean like I'm in the other room taking my shoes off she and she in the bathroom right, right, right. removing her makeup? Like such and such was so funny tonight. And I'm like, oh, then she nah, brings it up nah, again nah, afterwards. Nah. She yeah. never laughs like that in life. I like, I like your friend such and such. He's he's funny. You like, bitch. That's I'm hating. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I might, I might, it might be my shorty. Like, yo, cool. yeah, yeah, you gotta give me a side eyes. Well, listen, uh, before we get out of here, 2024 is just something in the air. Yeah, you know the number 24 is a magical number. I forgot what it means, but just take my word, it's magic. <laughs> this thing start saying <laughs> shit. <laughs> I like it. I'm rocking with you. It's magic. Uh, before we get out of here, man, like, what are some last words y'all have either for yourselves or for those tuning in? 
for what 2024 is to bring because we're in the beginning stages of it? Um, I'm going to say for me and hopefully for everybody else, um, new beginnings financially. Um, I have a lot of, I got big plans for what I want to work on it just as far as like getting my shit together financially, big on the financially part. Cause yeah. like brother, nobody wants to be broke this year. So that's a fact, man. So, um, that's so, 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 so turn it up, man. Yeah. You mean that's, that's all I'm gonna say is like really, really getting your bag for 2024. Like really, Fucking really bad. hustle. I don't care if you move in rock. Yeah, I, don't I don't care, care if you selling around. if you selling hair Ron. I don't, don't give a fuck if care, you. Care, don't, don't sell I don't it. give a fuck if you. You <laughs> mean pussy? pushing pushing any anything? It's it's always P. You mean that That's shit true. is always player. That's always player. It's always mm-hmm. gonna be P. No matter what it is that you pushing. So go ahead, sell it, sell a pack today. That's right. gonna be That's my crazy. message. Easy. All right. We giving a message to the people. Everybody. To to the people. To yourself. It's up to you. My biggest goal this year is to um, continue building my credit up. Uh, I want to, I'm working with my cousin to get my first property this year. So I want to, fire. thank you. I want to get like, leverage my credit. Cause even the people I be talking to a lot, see, they don't even use their debit. They don't, uh, all credit work. Yeah. Building this, that getting points. Even, I just want to take advantage of the thing, the perks that things have. Like, yeah. you know, like lounges and airports. Cause I got an Amex or this, mm. that, and the third. I never tapped into that because I always been just kind of doing, like doing shit off survival. Yeah. But I want to start tapping into like the benefits that life has with like credit and, you know, little travel hacks and yeah, shit like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Trying to do shit, shit like that yeah. instead of just doing it one offs because we tra- we about to travel a lot more. Yeah. So I want to make sure I'm taking advantage of that. So you don't yeah. just live life, breathe air. I know sometimes you're gonna get there and feel so wonderful. That was crazy. Y'all niggas get that? That was nah, insane. Live, live life, life, breathe air. Somehow you know we're gonna get there. It's so wonderful. What's, I'm telling you just how I feel. Just how I feel. Oh, oh I finally. Ah, yeah. Way the we fuck over say, my yeah, head, that was, bro. But that was crazy how you said that up. Way the even fuck gonna lie. over. My crazy. head, you're good. He's a, well, nice. he's a rapper, so well, yeah, well, yeah, rapped. You're good. So I get that. I get that. Um, mine's gonna be quick, real quick. I would just say, the beginning of this year, a great way to get somewhere where you've never been is to do stuff you've never done, and it starts with the smaller things. So I think changing your daily bad habits with good habits, getting those small wins can trickle up, make a snowball mm. effect, and lead to you That's having true. better results in life but it st- takes one step at a time you know step by step day by day and uh hey hey, hey. Learn by Lionel. Know, take yeah. it by Lionel. yeah yeah the yep. whole shebang so yep. you know i would say just replace the bad habits with good habits and watch those wins stack up and watch that change your frequency and attract more positive things in your life for the year 2024. Nice. Yeah. That's my this nigga really Eagles fan like too, y'all. So that's yeah. why we fucked up. Are you a Bears fan? Absolutely. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, my, my usual setup, like I got the helmets and all that, like my jersey collection, <laughs> all that shit is crazy. And I'll give a quick story on how it came on because people always ask, how the fuck are you Eagles fan? You're not from Philly. No, I'm not from Philly. I'm from Maryland. So is Brian Westbrook. His mom used to work with my grandfather in really? DC. And when I first started playing football, I lived with my grandparents. I played running back. He would tell Brian Westbrook's mom, Brian Westbrook, she would then tell Brian Westbrook, he then had a brand at the time and was sending me gear. To wear while I played football, and I'm oh. like, I'm in like fourth, fifth grade. That was mad Decked love, yeah. so I naturally attracted yeah. to the Eagles. Yeah. That's love. That's, That's love. fire. That's, That's fire. That's fan. fire. Yeah. So listen, Larry and Lionel, I truly appreciate y'all for pulling up. Absolutely. Um, Let me give you flowers real quick before we go. Yeah. I, I, first off, I found you, and I said, um, we go city to city. We try to find people, mm-hmm. and we we find, and we really don't find <clears> a bunch <throat> of people that's yeah. doing like actual quality work mm-hmm. so when i went to yes. your page i said this nigga care about his brand like i told you on facetime that time yeah. so this nigga cares he got clips he mm-hmm. got this like he consistent you know if you just had some rinky dinky bullshit i'd have been like we I wouldn't even have sent it to line or we wouldn't have scouted yeah. it yeah. so keep keep rocking like that because motherfuckers gonna keep finding you and now you know the, the network we built you are now part of it and we also part of your network welcome brother so it's like you're signed to death row yeah. my yeah. man you're in no. there bro. you're but in we there. travel around and just appreciate like you, sir. you know whatever you need from us like we tell yeah, people absolutely. holler at us you know we pull up if the shows pull, yeah. we do whatever anywhere you know, anytime we around. let us know yeah i appreciate that let man, us know. for real for real like i said it was a full circle moment when um you know you and uh, adrian hit me up so i'm definitely appreciative of it yeah, it's and love. uh we going 
First off, have great vibes for the rest of the night. The rest oh, yeah, of the, move, the rest of the movements, it's kickbacks, absolutely. whatever it is, functions gonna be lit. And then tomorrow for the live show, by the time this come out, it'll be passive. But for the live show, I know there's gonna be a motherfucking vibe. So I'm yeah. looking forward to yeah. that too. Yeah. Already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So I appreciate y'all. Appreciate y'all for tuning in, whether you're listening on your respective podcast platform, Apple Podcasts, Google, Spotify, the whole shebang. You can find it, link in the bio. If you're watching on YouTube, I ask that you go ahead and subscribe, like, comment, and share it out. Go ahead and spread that algorithm around. But until next time, ladies and gentlemen, make sure that y'all stay safe, stay sane, but most importantly, stay blessed. We out. Peace. 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 My nigga got the intros and outros and shit the fucking That's world. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Yeah.